Scombroid poisoning. Scombroid poisoning is caused by consuming improperly refrigerated fish. Scombroid is the common term for histamine fish poisoning. It gets its name from the family of fish scombridae such as tuna and mackerel, which typically cause the poisoning. However, a large variety of fish can cause scombroid, most of them dark meat fish. These fish have high levels of histidine in the meat. If the meat is improperly refrigerated, bacteria on the surface of the meat convert histidine to histamine, which is the principal cause of the symptoms. Common fish causing scombroid include tuna, mackerel, mahi-mahi, sardines, and others. Symptoms develop within minutes to an hour and resemble allergic reactions. Symptoms include flushing, headache, palpitations, itching, blurred vision, cramps, and diarrhea. Antihistamines can treat symptoms, with recovery expected within 12 to 48 hours. Prevention involves consuming properly stored fish as cooking does not eliminate scombroid risk. Saguatera poisoning. Saguatera fish poisoning is caused by eating fish contaminated with the naturally occurring toxins, ciguatoxins, that are produced by microorganisms that live around coral reefs. Basically, any fish which is an older or bigger specimen should be treated with caution as they have ultimately had more time to accumulate the toxin from eating smaller fish which have acquired it. Symptoms appear 3 to 6 hours after consumption and include nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and abdominal pain. Less common symptoms include tingling, dental discomfort, itching, metallic taste, blurred vision, and temperature sensitivity. Symptoms can last days to months with no definitive cure. Prevention includes avoiding barracuda, moray eel, and avoid consuming fish liver, intestines, eggs, or head. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscription button. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below in the comment section.